Hi there, and welcome to a new edition of Brian's Mind. This is Brian, and I don't have a mind. But, anyways, I was thinking of all the different subjects to talk about, and I decided, since Jeff's been playing old videos, that I would talk about a subject that was on an old video. Uh, about six months back, I had intense pain. I went to the emergency room, sat there for about six hours, and nobody ever seen me. And ended up being that I needed surgery because of why I went to the hospital. Now, what is bringing this up six months later, you ask? I got a bill from the hospital today for that, six months later. Just got it, six months later. They want to charge me. It's $184 to sit in their hallway for six and a half hours. Well, it sounds like a sleazy, slutty hotel going on there. You know, charging by the hour. I figured it breaks down to, what, 30 bucks an hour? That's quite steep for sitting in the hallway. And the hallway wasn't that spectacular. I could see if it was, you know, maybe painted really nice or, you know, had different pictures of the Sistine Chapel or had pictures of, you know, nice artwork or had big fish tanks or you know, something to look at. Then I could say, you know what, 30 bucks an hour is not such a bad deal. But then I thought about it, and I was like, what did they really do for me? They didn't do anything for me. So now, do I pay the money? Do I throw the bill away? Oh, no. What do I do? Hmm. Since I'm normally a quiet, reserved person, I would probably just send them a check. No. I think we go to plan A. And just to let you know, I never have a plan B. Plan A, throw the biggest hissy fit ever seen by a grown man on the phone. Now, I could videotape this, but if I start crying and tears roll down my eyes, would that look really good? No, it wouldn't. Now, why should I bitch? Because they didn't do anything. Now, is that the state of face healthcare that they charge you just to sit and check out the ambiance of the people around you and see the nurses and the doctors walk by? Sounds to me like universal health care would be the answer. Because then, when I sat in the hallway for six hours, I would know, hey, at least I'm not getting a bill. And I could be like, cool. Now, I'm sure they're going to say that I signed myself out against medical advice. It doesn't matter. I didn't have see anybody, so what kind of medical advice could they have given me to sign myself out? What, the receptionist? No, you can't stop. I work at a hospital. <laughs> if that's the case, I'll go find a custodian and say, hey, is it okay if I leave? I'm sure he'll give me the thumbs up. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't understand it. But, I'm just kind of curious, you know, wondering about the bill. And so maybe this weekend, if Jeff thinks about it, he can dust off that video and put it on the week of best of Brian so you'll know actually what I'm talking about or you can just go through all the old ones and you'll find it there but I just thought I'd bring up the old bill and until next time this has been Brian's Mind.